Hello everyone. Today we are going to do a problem based on leveling. In this table, some of the values are missing. We need to find the missing values and then we have to apply the arithmetic check. As we can see here, rise and fall method is used. From the previous problems, we know that to get to rise and fall, from the back side to the fore side, we have to subtract all of the readings one by one. If we get a positive value, that is rise. And if we get a negative value, that is fall. First, we need to take from this back side to this fore side. This reading minus this reading, we have got a rise so that it is positive. Let us keep this value as x. So 2.296 minus x, that will be positive 0 0.291. We can take minus x on the other side, so it will come as positive. And we can take this value on the other side, so it will come as negative. In this way for x, we will get 2.005. Let us enter that. Now we need to take from this back side to this fore side. This minus this, we will get minus 0 0.229, so that should be fall. And this minus this, we will get positive value, that is rise. Let us enter both of them. Then we need to consider from this back side to this fore side. This minus this, we have got to fall, so it should be negative. So x minus 2.348 is equal to minus 0 0.316 to find the x we have to take this value on the other side so it will come as positive in this way for x we will get 2.032 let us apply that now we have to take from this back side to the four side in the station number six there are two unknowns in this case we can to proceed here First, we need to find these reduced levels, then we can come back here. Let us find the reduced level in the station number 2. This plus this, we will get that. To find the reduced level in the station number 3, we have to subtract the fall by this reduced level, so that we will get this. To get the reduced level in the station number 4, with this reduced level, we have to add this rise, so that we will get this. To get the reduced level in the station number 5, we have to subtract this fall by this reduced level so that we will get this. In the station number 6, this reduced level is given. To get this reduced level, with this reduced level, we have to add this rise. We can take this on the other side, it will come as negative. In this way, we will get this rise as 0 0.102. Let us enter that. Now we can take from this back side to this uh, four side. This minus this, we will get positive 0 0.102 because that is the rise. Using that concept, we can find the x. Let us enter that. This minus this also, we will get positive 0 0.084. Using that, we can find the x. Then we need to take from this back side to this uh, four side. This minus this, we will get a negative value, so that should be in fall. In the station number 9, we have two unknowns, so we can to proceed here. First, we need to find these two reduced levels. This reduced level plus this rise, we will get this reduced level. Then, this reduced level minus this fall, we will get this reduced level. Here, we have rise. So this plus this, we will get this reduced level. Using that concept, we can find x. Let us enter that. Now we need to take from this back side to this four side. This minus this, we will get a positive value because it is a rise. For x, we will get 2.054. Let us enter that. Now we need to find the summation. When we add all of the back side, we will get this. When we add all of the four sides, we will get this. When we add all of the rise, we will get this. And when we add all of the falls, we will get this. Now we need to apply the check. Summation of backside difference, summation of foresight will be equal to summation of rise difference, summation of fall. 
and that will be equal to the difference between last oral and first oral for all of them we will get a same value hence okay now let us see one more problem in this problem also we need to find the missing values first let us find this missing value when we add these three we should get 5.749 using that concept we can find x this minus this we will get this rise this minus this we will get this fall this minus this should be minus 0 0.235 because it is a fall using that concept we can find x this minus this we will get positive 0 0.403 because it is rise using that concept we can find x when we add these three we will get this then we can find the reduced levels this plus this we will get this this minus this we will get this then this plus this we will get this finally we have to apply the check for all three of them we will get the same value hence okay now we are going to end this session thank you for watching this video